Hi, my name is Marie Penny. I'm the archivist at the Norton Museum of Art. Many of us who are able to work from home are taking this opportunity to revisit personal archives, perhaps by organizing old letters or photographs. It's a great way to honor the past while also looking towards the future. Here at the Norton, we have a very extensive archive, a rich history that spans 80 years of exhibitions, programming, acquisitions, the entire institutional memory. And today I would like to share a portion of that archive with you through some images that have been recently digitized from our slide collection. These images are from the 1970s and a common thread throughout them is community involvement. And while these images showcase in-person community, we greatly value connecting to our community at home through Norton From Home. I'm excited to bring these to you today starting with Atmospheric Sky Sculpture. Atmospheric Sky Sculpture was created by Professor Howard Woody of the University of South Carolina. Participation from the audience was required to blow up the sculpture, and anyone who spotted the flight pattern after it took off into the air was encouraged to contact the local paper. Hi, Mom, what's new? The Norton thought it was important for the public to see how artists were interpreting family during a time of rapid social change. Eight artists, five of which were women, were selected from around the country. The show offered a new approach to connect to the community. Instead of publishing a catalog, this sheet, including a checklist and artist statements, was featured in the Palm Beach Post Times. Lastly, young guests enjoying the permanent collection at the Norton and a show on loan from the High Museum of Art, Charles White, an American Experience. Thank you for watching Norton From Home, and I look forward to sharing more highlights from the archive with you.